Welcome to Evolution video series, VPAC NZ RX, Personal, Preferred and User-Defined Drugs. Personal Medicines. Only personal medications which have been mapped automatically to the NZ formulary drugs will be available for prescribing after VPAC NZ RX activation. Any personal medications that were created using NIMS drug or historic Pharmac medications that could not be mapped to New Zealand formulary drugs will no longer be available for prescribing after BPAC NZ RX activation and will need to be created as new medications using the New Zealand formulary drugs. However, if medications have been mapped automatically to NZF formulary, they will be available as personal medications when prescribing a new medication. As you can see here, it defaulted to the personal medicines, not the brand and generic. Preferred medication. As part of the BPAC NZRX activation, the existing MIMS drug formulary is removed from the MedTech Evolution application. The selection of any MIMS drug as a preferred medication will, be, will not be retained when the data is removed from MedTech Evolution. The provider must reinstate the preferred medication flags on the equivalent NZ formulary drugs through options clinical drug and select the preferred option in the coding tab for any drugs that they would like to be displayed as a preferred medication. So to do this, we go to the menu button, options, clinical, drug, Search for the preferred drug. Find whichever option is preferred and along with the um, strength. OK. And go to the coding tab, which is this one here. And tick that it is a preferred medication. OK to save. User-defined drugs. All current configured user-defined drugs will be available for prescribing after NZRX activation. If a user-defined drug was mapped to a MIMS generic group or drug class previously in the generic tab of the options clinical drug screen, it will need to be remapped to the equivalent NZF generic name or NZF alerting group after activation of BPAC and ZRX to ensure that they can be suitably recognised when performing patient medical warning, cross-checking during prescribing. If no generic name or alerting group is specified, no medical warning checks are possible. So to do this, we would go to menu, options, clinical, drug, and search for the user-defined drug that has been entered. In this case. And if required, a generic name can be added here. Or alerting group. By clicking on the Add button here. Again, save will save those changes.